Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue with Valorant. Whenever you run it, you got the error of Windows cannot access the specified device, path or file. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and proceed with the resolution. First of all, right click on your Valorant and choose the option properties over here. Now here click on the compatibility tab and here check mark the option run this program as an administrator and secondly is disable full screen optimization. Hit apply. OK button and try to launch the game again and check if the error is still there or not. If this doesn't fix, let's proceed with the next step. Right click on start menu and choose the option task manager over here. Now here in the processes tab, if you have find a process with the name MSI Afterburner, Riva Tuner or Citrix VPN, make sure you close each of three applications one by one by right clicking and choose the option end task. Because these are the processes that are conflicting with the Valorant, which gives you the error of Windows cannot access the specified device path or file. If this also fails, let's proceed with the third step. Head over to C drive. Here, open Roet Games folder. If you have a different directory, make sure to open the Roet Games folder over there. Then click on the option Roet Client, and here is the Roet Client services. Go ahead, right click on it, and choose the option open this will go ahead and directly launch roet client valorant for you go ahead sign in and play your valorant game if this fix out you need to right click on it and choose the option show more options click on set to and click on the option desktop this will create a desktop file for you here it is now you can launch directly from here to play the valorant if this also failed, let's proceed with the fourth step. Click on the start menu and type notepad. Open notepad and here paste a command that I will share you in the description of this video. Once pasted, hit the file menu and choose the option save as. Save it onto your desktop. Give it a name valorant launch.bat. In save as type, choose the option all files. Hit the save button. Here is the file created. Now go ahead and double click to run this file and this will launch again Valorant for you to fix out the issue of Windows cannot access the specified device path or file. Now if this method also failed, let's proceed with the last step. Right click on start menu and choose the option run. Type here percentage program data percentage and hit the enter key. Here find the folder with the name Roet Games as well as Valorant. If Valorant is not available, only Roet Games folder is there. Go ahead, right click and choose the option delete. Once it is deleted, again open the run command and this time type here percentage local app data lo percentage and hit the enter key again. Now again find two folders. First one is Valorant and second one is Roet Games. Once selected both the folders, you need to right click on it and choose the option delete. This will delete both the folders and it will reset your Valorant settings and this will completely fix out the issue of Valorant. Windows cannot access the specified device path or file in your Windows PC. So this is all about it friends. This is how you will fix out the issue. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.